Hello friends, welcome to Shiva Academy. This video series is mainly to address the questions and the comments that I am receiving through mail or in the comment section. As a continuation of that, here is a question I have received on the video number 39 of SQL practical question series. So in video number 39, I have showed a logic to check whether two strings are anagram of each other and this specific comment is based on that. First let me explain what is an anagram and how to check whether two strings are anagram of each other or not and what was the logic I have implemented in this specific video then we'll revisit this comment again. So anagram is nothing but a word or a phrase is formed by rearranging the characters of another word. For example, if you have a word called heart, we can form another word just by rearranging the character of this specific word. So in this case, these two words are said to be anagram of each other. In fact, in this video, I have showed one method of implementation to check whether two strings are anagram of each other. Let me just quickly show you what was the logic implemented in this video. Then we'll revisit the comment again. Suppose if you have like two string like a silent and another string called listen. To check whether these two strings are anagram of each other, in the video number 39, what I have implemented is, first I used to convert the string into a row of character. For example, the string silent into a row of character and very similar to this, the word listen also into a row of character. Then what I did is, I converted back the rows into a string again. But while converting it back, I have ordered in an alphabetical order. So the silent I am converting into a row and then while converting back into a string, I just ordered in the alphabetical order of the characters. Similarly, the listen also I am ordering in the alphabetical order. So what happens here is that if these two strings are equal, then silent and listen are said to be anagram of each other. This is the logic I have implemented in this video. Okay, now let us revisit the comment again. So the comment is, can we take the sum of ASCII character of all the characters in each string and then can we compare the summation? If the sum is equal, then can we say that these two strings are anagram of each other or not? So the question is, can we calculate the ASCII code and take the summation of ASCII character of all the characters, then can we compare? Yes, it is possible. In fact, I have never used this ASCII function till now, even in real time uh, applications. But this is one good use case where we can use this ASCII function. Fine. Now let me show you how to use ASCII character to check whether two strings are anagram of each other or not. So let us take the two strings again, the string silent and the string listen. So now what I'm going to do, I'm going to find the ASCII character of each character in the string. For example, the ASCII character of S is 83, I is 73 and very similar to that, we'll take the ASCII characters of other characters also. And similarly for listen also, let us take the ASCII character of each character. Once you have taken the ASCII character, just take the summation of the ASCII character of both the strings. So now, if the summation of ASCII characters of both strings are equal, then the word silent and listen are said to be anagram of each other. Now let me show you how to implement this logic using SQL. So let us take two words. So let's take silent. So let us give as like string one. Let us take another word listen as a string two from dual. Okay. Now let me make this as a with class query. Let's say with data set as this one select star from our data set. Yes. Now let me select string one and string two. Now what I'm going to do, I'm just going to convert this back into a row of characters. Connect by level less than or equal to length of string one. Okay, length. Yeah. Now what I'm going to do, I'm just going to convert the string into a row of character. For that, I'm using the substring. Let's take string one from each level position. Let us extract one character. 
so silent we have converted into a row of character let me give alias like character one or c1 similarly let us convert the string two also into row of characters let me say c2 so silent we have converted similarly listen also we have converted now what i'm going to do i need to find the ascii value of each character so we have a function called ascii so let us take whatever the first character and give us input to the ascii function so this is the ascii value let me give alias as a1 very similar to this let us find the ascii character of all the characters in string 2 let me give alias as a2 anyway now we are not interested in the character because we just need only the ascii characters now that we have a silent listen and the ascii character of all the character in silent similarly the ascii character of all the characters in listen so now let us take the summation so let me write a outer query let's say select s1 comma s2 comma sum of the ascii value that is a1 similarly sum of a2 from let us make this as inner query then let's say group by s1 comma s2 so that this will give the summation of the ascii characters now we need to check whether these two sums are equal or not so let's say case when sum of a1 equal to sum of a2 then let's say valid anagram else let's say not anagram and so this is our output okay let's execute this so now this is saying silent and listen are valid anagram let's say earth and let's say heart so earth and heart are valid anagram let's give any other character let's say a b c d so earth and a b c d are not valid anagram if you want any questions to be answered you can post it in the comment section or you can drop to this mail id but before that you can check whether a similar question has already been answered as part of the subscriber question series or as part of the interview question series if you're not able to find your question here please write back to me if you've learned something new please like this video subscribe and stay tuned for new feature video interview question sql practical question and concept videos and thanks a lot for watching this video please click the bell icon if you want to receive instant notification whenever new videos are uploaded into this channel thank you